Hi, I'm Miriam Joy and welcome to my studio. Love is in the air. Well, at least love for Valentine's crafts. So I want to go back and revisit some of the ones that I think you would really enjoy. Let's get started. I'm Miriam Joy and welcome to my studio. We're getting ready for Valentine's and we're making these little fun Valentine lights and they're really inexpensive and they're quick and simple, a lot of fun to do. I went to the Dollar Tree and I found these little Valentine treat boxes and there was 10 in a bag. And my lights I picked up after the holiday season was over and everything goes on clearance and it's up to 80% off. And I was looking for a strand of 20 and I was unfortunately able to find a strand of 50. So I really would have liked to have done the 20, but the 50 is just fine too. During that season, always look for Valentine's stuff because Christmas has a lot of red stuff that goes on clearance that you can use for Valentine's Day. So that's usually where I purchase my items from. And then how we're going to get these to string onto the light, I'm going to take these and I'm going to start, I'm going to put my hole with an ice pick because it's larger right in the middle of the plastic down the center of that heart. And I'm going to just walk it through. And if you had a really large nail the size of the lights, you could probably use that. But my hole isn't big enough, so I'm going to finish drilling it out with a 3 16th drill. Now you need the hole there, otherwise the bit just slides all over. And you need a little bit of a sharper one that can catch on to the hole that you've put there. We're going to drill that right through, and you can see that's really simple, but like I said, if you had a larger nail that was that big, you could use that as well. And all you're doing is wanting it large enough just to slide onto the lights, but not so big that it comes off the lights. And that's cute, just like that without the top as well. So we're going to take our E6000. And you can get that at MiriamJoy.com if you're having a problem finding it. And I'm going to glue, put little glue just around the lid so that when we set this on, it's not going to come off. Don't need a lot, just a little bit to secure that lid. Just going to set it right on there. And then once that's dry, you're just going to simply put it onto your light strand. Now, I did every other one, and I had these hanging up in my living room last night, and that was really, really cute. I liked every other one, but if you wanted to do every one, you could do that as well. Just buy as many as you need to uh, complete your string. I also did little wax treat boxes, and that's going to be a different video. You could put those on there as well. Make sure that your lights are indoor lights, that they're not outdoor lights so they don't get really, really warm. You want to make sure of that. But wouldn't the little hearts on there be cute? They probably wouldn't show quite up as much at night as they would during the day, but that would also be a really cute thing to do to all of them as well. So that is really simple and a fun project. And then you can have your house looking Valentine decorated <laughs> Valentine. I don't know what you call that. Ready for Valentine's. There we go. We'll have to add this one to the bloopers too. So I hope you have a great loving season. And we wish you all the best from Miriam Joy. Check out all of our current stuff on MiriamJoy.com. God bless. You.